This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Kansas City. New research shows that nearly a third of patients who suffered from cardiac arrest were not defibrillated within the critical two-minute window, cutting the chances of survival in half. Risk factors for these delays included being admitted for non-cardiac causes, being admitted to a hospital with fewer than 250 beds, and having the event after regular working hours. From Maryland, the FDA has approved a test that checks for methicillin-resistant staph aureus. The test, called BD Genome Staph SR assay, delivers results within a few hours and was shown to have a sensitivity of 100 percent and a specificity of 98 percent. Given the rise in prevalence of MRSA, this new assay could result in significant savings for the health care system. And finally, from Chicago, disrupted sleep may raise the risk for diabetes. Researchers monitored a group of healthy individuals who slept in an environment where 300 audible sounds were delivered. The subjects experienced the equivalent of giving a 20-year-old the same quality of sleep as a 60-year-old. The results show that disrupted sleep altered insulin sensitivity by 25%. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.